I'm just doing this for assignments, but I might be thinking about moving this to like an entire course grade. And so the point system, the way it's working out is I have, for some reason, I decided to do this. I have longer assignments, which I'm calling full, and they're each worth 40 points. And I have half assignments that happen here and there, and these are only worth 20 points. Um, and the idea is that that'll total, total at the end of the semester, 260 points, I believe. But what I'm going to do is that no matter how many points they have, it's actually going to be out of 200, not 260. So if they rake up 200 points out of 260, they get 100% on their homework grade, uh, which is a different way of, instead of saying like, oh, I'll drop the lowest homework score, you know, sometimes a student might have a 50% and a 50%, but only one of those gets dropped, but a student might have a zero and a hundred and the zero gets dropped. And that feels really different, right? And sometimes it's not that there's one week when you couldn't do anything, so you get a zero, but there's a couple of weeks where you couldn't do too much, you know? And so it's just much more flexible for the students in terms of uh, even not handing in a problem set at all, or just trying one problem out of four or whatever they can muster. And this way they can still show me that they're trying to follow as much as they can the course I think it also right encourages them to actually try out a problem set and try to get something out of it instead of just deciding, well, that one's just going to get dropped, so I'm not even going to look at it, you know. So hopefully they they keep up to date as much as possible. Um, and yeah, so I'll see. You know, this is my first time doing it, so I'll see at the end of the semester. Uh, you know, if students seem to like it. <laughs>